I've got a sparkling water, a sparkling wine spritz with elderflower, and a sparkling wine. The wine with the flower. <laughs> the spritz, yeah, perfect. Yes. <laughs> Have you joined us in the mint experience before? Yes, but well, this is my first time in the studio. Did awesome. You know yeah. Well, welcome. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you have the most coveted seat on JetBlue. Thank you. Uh, so, uh, the studio is very similar. Sorry, the, yes, the studio is very similar to the suite. Yes. Um, the main difference would be obviously the the accompanying seat where you can have someone join you. You've got an additional tray table right inside here that will flip up and then flip down. Okay. So you have a little more space uh, to spread out with your work or for dining. Uh, we do have your closet here, so you have a little space there for your, with your vanity. Um, the tray operates the same way as on the other seats. Um, you do have your power outlet here, and the input for the headphones is right here. We left you a master and dynamic headset, and an amenity kit. There's a comfort kit right behind you as well that has a pillow and blanket. Perfect. And I think that covers most of it. We got left you a flat water there in the yeah. uh, okay. in the little cubby. Yeah, I like oh, the, perfect. the seat. <laughs> Excellent. Well, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Thank Please you. let me know if you have any questions. Okay. We did leave you a menu. Um, we'll encourage you to place your order with the screen. Okay. Just follow the prompts on the screen to select the, the items. It's mostly a confirmation of what you that you'd like to have service. Okay. Um, it, with the shut eye service, we have a little prefix menu. Mm -hmm. The idea is that when we take off, we'll come out and try to deliver that service as quickly as we can, uh, so you can begin resting, resting. as okay. soon as possible. I don't think I'm going to sleep much. Really. No. Okay, that's <laughs> fine too. Yeah. I'll be here the whole time. Okay. Thank we can, you. You can chat. <laughs> Thank you. Excellent. Welcome. All right, so let's get settled in on this flight. I didn't realize my butt was this big. Like, I was looking at this video. I was like, "You really have this big butt?" Okay. <laughs> I think this outfit just brought out my butt. But this outfit, this outfit is really, really comfortable. I got it on Shein, and I think when traveling, I just like to wear clothes that are like really nice and comfortable. So I put on the seat belt. I like the seat belt. It goes across your shoulder. So we're flying to London and the food is served. This is the food. It's mostly Italian food that they serve on JetBlue Mint. It's really nice and delicious. I'm so used to their food at this point. I love their uh, mocktail. This is my favorite mocktail with JetBlue Mint. It's their mint zero proof. So no alcohol. I think they make it with ginger ale and something else, some spritz or whatever, whatever. I don't know, but it tastes good. And I like that they put fresh cucumber. So this is their regular sweet. Um, I forgot where I was flying to at this point. Yeah. At this point, yeah, we've done too many JetBlue mints. Uh, but this is what the regular sweet looks like. It doesn't give you that extra um, seating section like the studio does. And um, yeah, so we're about to eat. They give you restaurant style type of serving. You get your silverware cutlery. And my favorite thing about JetBlue means food is actually the dessert. I'm always looking forward to the ice cream. <laughs> the food itself is good. Honestly, I feel like it's better than a lot of US airlines. However, to be honest, JetBlue, because you guys are one of my favorite, and I want to tell you the truth when you guys are declining in terms of quality, I feel like you guys don't have a lot of options to choose anymore when it comes to protein with the food. In the beginning, I could choose beef, chicken, pork and sometimes i will have two proteins with the food but i've noticed that has changed so i don't know what happened maybe you guys need to improve on that they brought the pre-arrival food and i like this extra section of the couch when you turn the seat into a bed the couch section extends as well so it's nice for you to get so much space just like you know wiggle around so i got some yogurt cappuccino and croissant and I'm showing you the section again. So it extends with the bed and gives you a lot of space to just spread out. But um, yeah, the flight is very comfortable, very nice. You can lay down on, and sleep. So we are about to land. I don't know if you can see the wireless charging right by the window. Yeah, it's cool that you could charge your phone. But we're in London now and I'm in the Uber going to my hotel and this is like my fourth time coming to london the first three times i was a kid and it feels good to come back as an adult so like a lot of memories is just flashing through my mind as i'm in this uber 
And a lot of these memories were not so good. So I'm still processing this trip. So I haven't gotten the chance to sit down and just write what I'm feeling. But my favorite thing is meeting my childhood best friend. <laughs> Cheers to meeting you again after what? Like 11 years, I think. Maybe 12. 12. Oh, yeah. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> it it smells so good. Like she took me to one of the most delicious Greek restaurant food like I've had in my life. The pasta was so delicious. They actually serve you the food. Like this is an expensive area. She told me like celebrities come here and I think she knows my bougie side. So I was like, I am so impressed with this place. Like this is amazing. So she wanted to make sure she take me to the best place. And um, yeah, I was, oh my God, guys minus the food like i just was so my heart was so full to actually like get to meet her again and like i felt like i was back home like that's how it felt that's how the reconnection felt so i love your british accent by the way mm. it's really nice <laughs> say it again say it again oh, thank you <laughs> <laughs> Come on, tea. this is my british sister oh, hey okay so are we taking the bus um, we're taking a train. A train? Yes. Well, the bus is right there. This is the really... Maybe we could hop on the bus and hop off. Um, actually, we can do that when we get to Tower Oh, I love the accent. Yeah. Actually, <laughs> we could do that when we get to Tower Bridge. <laughs> There's the Ritz. The Ritz. The Ritz. We're in Central. Central, Central London. London. We're yeah. going to see the bridge, right? Yeah, we're going to Tower Bridge. Yeah. Where we're gonna see all the wait what we're gonna see the, um London Bridge. Yeah. Um, you know, like London Bridge is falling down. That's my sister! <laughs> <laughs> You're in you don't know how hard it is to see her. <laughs> I haven't seen her in like twelve years. Oh it was amazing, like I love the restaurant. I, I love trade, I wouldn't trade tonight for anything. Like, I know, right? This is like Oh, Ooh, look, at look at the cars. <laughs> oh cool. Wow. Is this no this is not a Ferrari. Oh the cars look No, we need to make money. That's what it is. Yeah, we do. <laughs> so she gave me a gift, guys. So um this trip is actually after my 30th birthday and she gave me my birthday gift. Like how much more loved can I feel? She gave me a very cute teddy bear and the teddy bear is holding a gift so let's open it it smells so good ah. a teddy bear holding a gift okay let's open the gift ah, it's a perfume Smells like beautiful rose. Hmm. Rose, candy, vanilla mixture. I love it. I love it. Thank you, Nero. You're amazing. I love it. I'm definitely going to cuddle with this teddy bear. That's for sure. This will be my cuddle bunny. The following day, I went to do a photo shoot. Um, yeah, so like it was so much trying to do this photo shoot because I only had a day in London. This is basically the perfect description. It was so hazy, it was so rushed trying to find the photographer, but the pictures came out really nice as you can see. So yeah, I took some photos and, and then I head on to the train to go to Paris. So up next is Paris. <laughs> 